All right, so chapter four, season three begins tomorrow, and we do know the full battle pass because Fortnite themselves released teasers for each and every single skin. Now, as you should be aware, there's eight skins in a battle pass. One of them is the quote, secret skin. So we just found out yesterday that Optimus Prime would be tier 100. But the other question on everyone's mind is which skin is the secret skin? So of these eight, obviously one of them has to be it. We knew that. Now, three days ago on June 5th, the data miner and leaker Sheena said this, the next secret skin is a new version of an already existing skin. As I have previously leaked, the secret skin is not a collaboration. This information remains accurate. Both of these leaks are coming from a reliable source. So that was three days ago before we knew the entire battle pass. What he told us is that it would not be a collaboration and it would be a reskin of an already existing skin. So then we got the information of these eight skins and we could couple the Sheena information with these skins and narrow it down who it is. So obviously there's only one collaboration here and that's Optimus Prime. We could scratch him off. Plus we know he's now tier 100, so he's not the secret skin. Now of the remaining skins, we do have some obvious reskins of previous characters. So first and foremost is the Mariposa skin. She is an unmasked version of Dynamo. So she potentially could be the secret skin. Then we have the Relic skin. And most people right off the bat thought this is going to be the secret one. Everyone was saying that this is the same as the Ruin skin from Chapter 1, Season 8. And that made a lot of sense, to be honest, because there's this theory going around, and I mentioned this before, that Chapter 4 is going in reverse of Chapter 1. So, for example, the last season in Chapter 1 was Season X. And that kind of mimics the theme of Chapter 4 Season 1. And then in Chapter 4 Season 2, our current season, it was futuristic. And what was Chapter 1 Season 9? Futuristic. So continuing that pattern, Chapter 4 Season 3 would be the same as Chapter 1 Season 8. So it would make sense if this Relic skin was just a reskin of the Ruin from Chapter 1 Season 8. So I was going to do a video about that yesterday, but I decided to hold off and I'm glad I did. I saw some pretty big content creators yesterday say, hey, this is the secret skin. It's 100% confirmed. It's the Relic skin. Well, it turns out that's not the case because there's one other skin on this list of eight that's a reskin, and that is Paradise Meowsles. So obviously we've had a few renditions of Meowsles, but he was a Battle Pass skin. But no one would have thought that this would be the secret skin. There's no way they would make this the secret skin, right? But those are our three potential candidates. The... Mariposa, the Relic, or the Paradise Meowsles. All the other ones are original and or collaboration. Well, Sheena tweeted this morning and he said the following. Paradise Meowsles is the secret slash bonus skin of Fortnite Wilds. Then he put, according to a reliable source, the skin has two variants. So I wonder if he'll be able to transform into an animal. That would be kind of cool. But Meowsles always tends to have a built-in emote. So I'm excited to see what, if anything, that turns out to be. Now let's just talk about this for a minute because it's trending right now as of me making this video because everyone is super mad about this and I don't understand the hate. I, for one, said this is the worst skin in the Battle Pass. That was my opinion and I did receive a little bit of flack for saying that yesterday because a lot of people love Meowsles. But reading the comments of people finding out that this is the secret skin, people are furious about it and I just don't understand it. So remember, with the secret skin, you don't get it until halfway through the season, sometimes even later. So if you don't like this being the secret skin, does that mean you don't like the skin as well? Because if that's the case, it's good that it's the secret skin because it's near the end of the season. You don't get him right away. You won't have to use him right away. So wouldn't it be better that he's the secret skin this season? Imagine if it was Optimus Prime. Then you wouldn't be able to use him until near the mid or end of the season. And I, for one, hate that. So I guess I just don't understand why everyone's freaking out because if you're not gonna use him anyway and you don't like this skin, then I think it's good that he is the secret one because then you don't have to worry about him clogging up your battle pass. Now real quick, I just wanted to talk about why we call it the secret skin because all the time I get comments, why do you call it the secret skin? We know it's not a secret anymore, but that's just the terminology that people used. Back in the day, in chapter one, they were actually a secret. And most seasons, they are kept secret. We're not supposed to know about them. But more recently, I think because of all the leaks and the data miners, they do make them public. For example, we knew Mr. Aaron Yeager 
was the secret skin last season. No hiding it right there. But as far as even in Chapter 2, some of the skins weren't revealed until the mid-season. So yes, the terminology is a bit outdated, but that's what they were formerly known as, and that's what we call them today, the secret skin. So it's not secret anymore, clearly, or I wouldn't even be doing this video, but that's what we call these skins. So don't get too mad about the terminology. But what do you guys think about this? I'm curious as to my fan base's reaction. I thought people would be excited that we've got an original skin, despite it being a reskin. It's still original, as opposed to Optimus Prime, aka a collaboration. I guess I'm just not understanding the hate. Who would people rather see as the secret skin? Now, I also saw a lot of people upset because the secret skin is usually storyline related, but I don't think this skin is going to affect the storyline that much. If anything, they did this because the 14 Days of Summer event will probably coincide with when he comes available. And I, for one, think that's the reasoning. So let me just take you on a trip down memory lane. So there has been 21 secret skins since I've started playing. Not all of them have been storyline related. Now, I know the Attack on Titan collaboration was a pretty big deal last season, but it was the Thunder skin, which wasn't even Tier 100 or the Secret skin, that got the most storyline plot. But anyway, these are all the Secret skins we've had. Now, there's a lot of collaborations. Aaron Yeager, Geralt of Rivia, then we had the Herald, which was original. Pretty solid skin there, but then we went to Indiana Jones, the Prowler. Then we had the Foundation, which everyone was super hyped for. This was actually a fan favorite. He still is very solid. I love that skin. We had another original skin, the Cube Queen. Then we had a slew of Chapter 2 secret skin collaborations. Clark Kent, a.k.a. Superman. Probably one of the least favorite ones, Neymar Jr. The Predator. I love this one. That was such a good secret skin. Lots of things coinciding with him. Wolverine was also amazing. Aquaman, it fit the season for sure. Deadpool, this is one people most regret not playing that season because this is the only way you could have got Deadpool. This is it. Plus he's got the Mask Off style and the X-Force version if you want that. And he was actually the first collaboration in the Secret Skin department. Everything before that was original. So we got Sorana, we got the Scientist, Singularity with her multiple styles by the way. The Ruin skin, which we already touched base on. The Prisoner. The AIM skin. The Enforcer. And the very first one, Chapter 1, Season 4, The Visitor. So a lot of collaboration skins between Chapter 2 and Chapter 4. But there is some originality sprinkled in. Looking at this list, I think this is going to be the first reskin. Now, I know we got different renditions of some of these skins now, such as Wolverine and Neymar Jr. But when all these came out, they were the first of their kind. Whereas with Paradise Meowsles... He's going to be a reskin. So this is officially, I believe, the first reskin we ever had in the secret skin department. So there you go. I just wanted to touch base on this. A lot of people disappointed by it, but again, I just don't see the hate. I, for one, wasn't going to use this skin anyway. And because it's now the secret skin, you don't have to worry about using him or doing anything with him until the middle or end of the season. And like I said, I think it's going to coincide with the 14 days of summer event, but we'll see. So there you go. Let me know in the comments what do you think about this. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.